Welcome back, Chronics. Today we're talking about dislocations and subluxations. Oh my God, ew, David. Super, super painful because our collagen is altered and ligaments and tendons have a ton of collagen, kind of the framework of our body that holds our joints in place. Everything is falling apart. Other reasons we're prone to dislocations is well, we're tired. So like I said, our ligaments and tendons were just like, we're over it. You are exhausted. Also because we've shown people, maybe in our past, how flexible we were, done a few party tricks. Hey, look what I can do. And my personal favorite, muscle spasms. Sorry, sorry, muscle spasms. First step when you have a subluxation or a dislocation, don't Panic. Relax. Funny story. Years ago, before I even knew I had EDS, I was bartending, and there were these two women drinking wine, and all of a sudden, one of the women started screaming, and I looked over, and her shoulder had popped out of place. That was scary. And she had just literally moved her body. Okay, don't freak out. Her friend said, take another big sip of wine. Take a deep breath and relax. And you know what? That shoulder popped right back in. I couldn't believe it. So I think the lesson we take away from this is when we have a subluxation, dislocation, where is the wine? Wine here, get your wine. They're recommending heat over cold just because the heat will help relax our muscle spasms and hopefully just kind of glide that joint back into place where it belongs. Warmed and cozy. The last time I had a subluxation of a rib, I was reaching for a glass too fast and felt something pop and ow. The only thing that made it better was getting in a certain position in a recliner and propping up different parts of my body so there wasn't pressure on that rib. I'll support you supporting me supporting him. And then using the heat to stop the muscle spasms and then instead of painkillers I prefer marijuana edibles also known as medibles definitely help relax the muscles and I know why. It's magic weed. After you're fully medicated, they recommend gentle massage. I need a little bit more massage. To get the joint back into place. They don't recommend going to the ER for us unless we lose feeling, turns a different color, bad numbness or tingling. Feeling much better. It only hurts when I breathe. Because each time doctors forcefully try and push it back in, we just stretch out our ligaments and tendons more. So. That was counterproductive, I've got to be honest. Thanks for joining me again, and remember, stay true to yourself, and don't take crap from anyone. I'll see you guys next time.